welcome back to the channel you guys this is sky life projects much love and major blessings today it's a very special video because we are doing the full install for the coilovers and the lower control arms the lcas by cusco if you guys saw my previous video these were for the revel gt touring coilovers and the cusco lower control arms on top of that we are also going to go get an alignment done uh, that is the plan for today if it's not in this video it will be in the next video for the alignment but the plan is to get everything done in one swoop i'm here right before nine o'clock in the morning in glendale arizona at reliable subaru garage i'll throw the link up right here there it is so shout out to rsg they have done you know a pretty substantial amount of work on this vehicle for this project but you guys before we start this video if you could please like and subscribe hit that notification bell so you'll always be alerted for future uploads like this this is sky life projects let's get this video started here we go all right y'all so it's kind of a mess right here um here's the camera work but basically the coilovers are right here the lower control arms are right here and also i did forget to add we are going to be putting on a new rotor because the one that was damaged you know it has to be replaced so i forgot we're replacing one more rotor today literally totally forgot about that there's just so much going on in life sometimes we forget stuff right but it's all there and um you know i'm gonna unbox everything again to show you guys hopefully i can get some footage in the garage wait for the car to go by the truck hopefully i can get some footage in the garage that is up to the guys at reliable subaru garage they are doing a complete remodeling here so i imagine i might not be able to do that but i'm gonna have you know touch base with them see what he says all right you guys i'm gonna set the camera up on that and i'll be back in just a moment late all right y'all so i understand this is another day it's a whole different day but this is the final product this is how it looks currently how the car is sitting right this is lowered to spec and i'm going to walk you guys around the car so you can see how dope i mean it is literally in my opinion perfect took a couple tries but honestly i believe it's there so i'm gonna walk you guys around my wrx you let me know in the comments what you think but again this is to spec and i'm going to explain that in just a moment so let's take it here i'm not even gonna cut the video i'm just gonna look right here place the camera there i am losing light here however you guys look all right, this is how the front of my WRX looks currently. This is with 18 by nine and a half, okay? With a plus 44 on the wheels. However, five millimeter spacers have been added to the front and to the rear. So that brings it now to a total at a plus 39, both front and rear. Obviously, we need that plus five millimeters on the front to clear the BBK, right? It's got to clear the big brake kit. Now, let me show you the rear. Let's bring it back over here. You guys can see it as I'm moving it, right? Look how sleek it looks. So, we come right to here, all right? It shows the plus five millimeters really poking out right now so again 18 by nine and a half plus 44 both front and rear wrapped on 265s now in the revel gt touring coilovers with the cusco lcas everything is lowered to spec however this is a preload alignment the final alignment yeah <laughs> We're not done yet. The final alignment will be done on Wednesday, July 3rd, 9 a.m., okay? That's when everything will be to spec, 
with the lower control arms and the coil overs, right? That's when it's going to show currently everything being aligned. Is it out of alignment right now? I know I'm probably gonna get asked that. It is a bit off, but it's nothing drastic, okay? I'm trying to get this camera straight here. There we go. Okay, it's nothing drastic. Honestly, really, it performs still well. It corners still fine. It doesn't go left to right. It doesn't swerve all over the road, nothing like that. It goes a little bit to the right is basically what I'm trying to say. So it needs that final alignment. Yeah, it's better to save the tires, right? Because if I don't do a full alignment, then my tires are just going to get shredded eventually. Like maybe not right away, but within I would say a month to two months to probably be no more tire okay so let me pause the video here I'm gonna set it up and we'll be back all right y'all so you guys let me know what you think in the comments does it look good some people suggest it could be a little bit lower but honestly if I go any lower like 0.3 to 0.4 millimeters I'm gonna be touching those fenders you guys not everybody understands. These are on 265, 35, 18 tires, right? So they already have the poke. And with that plus 39 offset, they're poking out just enough to match the, you know, the splitter kit from Flow Designs. And I'm gonna bring the camera around one more time and I'm gonna show you guys what I'm talking about. And then we'll end this video here, okay? Let me see if I can get the closest possible with the light I have to show you guys what I'm talking about, okay? So that's about as close as I can get it. Look, I'm right there. It's this much. That's all I have. So I've already had people telling me, Jay, you can drop it about 0.2 millimeters. If I'm right there, this kit, this little, not kit, excuse me, the, the side, the side, um, what do you call it, cladding is going to intrude into the tire. I mean, and then that's gonna run into problems. So, honestly, that that is literally about 0.2 millimeters left. And I'm not kidding, I'll show you guys on the rear. The shop is not gonna go any lower, you guys, because they said, again, the cladding, okay? It's gonna clash right here with the tires. That's as close as I can get it here for the front and rear, but okay, we get the point, right? So. All right, you guys, before we get back to the video, I just wanted to show you what the coilovers look like under the hood. You have your dampening settings right here, soft to the left, hardness to the right. So counterclockwise for soft, clockwise for hard. It is set at a 15 adjustment each side. So I still have a bit of that dampening force, right? For like, you know, it's it's gonna be, there's up to 32 different dampening adjustments. So right now it's set at 15, so basically half. And I still have a very comfortable ride. And it is also aggressive when it wants to be with the 15 clicks each side like around turns, cornering, etc. So just wanted to give you guys a close up of those. Sorry about the light, but look, they're just beautiful, man. Like honestly, it just, they don't clash. They really just match the Cusco blue as you guys can see right there. So yeah. All right, y'all, let's get back to the video. Come on. But all right, y'all, hope you did enjoy that video. If you did, please, hit that thumbs up button for me. I greatly appreciate it. It helps out the channel. If you haven't subscribed already, please subscribe. This is another video with Sky Life Projects. Much love, major blessings. You guys, I do want to apologize. I'm not able to do a video or even two videos every week. I am super busy and swamped with work with my kids. Visitation now with kids is obviously a completely different ball game when you're going through a divorce. Plus, I also have time with my girlfriend, okay? 
Yes, I spend time with her and you know what I mean? It's just, there's just a lot going on in life right now. So I do want to apologize that I'm not able to make those videos happen for you guys every single week. However, the videos will be uploaded, I would say every two weeks getting to that three week mark. Right now, that's just how it is. There is more coming up for this project. Obviously, I do want to add more projects in the future to the channel that, you know, my income allows me to. So, th there's just there's just a lot coming up. And honestly, this channel isn't going anywhere. I don't want you guys to think that it's going somewhere. It's not. I appreciate every one of you guys, all my subscribers. Thank you so much for showing your dedication, your support, taking time out of your day to watch my videos. Okay? I love y'all. Wait until next video, and I'll show you what's coming up. Don't go anywhere. Skylight Project. Let's roll.